And in fact, most priests, if you think about it, if, probably in your own life you experience this, if you've gone to confession, reconciliation, and you've spoken about a certain person of which you don't forgive or you're struggling to forgive, the penance for me has always been, without a doubt, pray for that person. And not just like, all right, I was like all excited, go pray for them, I can do this, Lord. Thank you, Father, this is the best penance ever. I kneel down, dear Lord, change them. I've just prayed for them, but that's not what God was asking me to. Dear Lord, do you know what their problem is? They need this, 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 and this. Fix them. Yeah, not so much. Not so much. Over time, through God's grace, my prayers changed, and I understood God softly and gently said, that's not what I'm calling you to do. Now my prayer is like, dear Lord, love them. Protect them. Bring them all the beauty and the love of, in my life that you've given me. Give them the same. Give them health. Give them, prosper them. Whatever it is, Lord, that will bless them, Lord, you give them to. You give that to them. Do you know how hard that is to say that with a pure and honest heart? Like, how do we get to that point? I think for women, it's in our nature. It is there because we're so nurturing and we're so loving and we so want the good for other people. But that nurturing also leaves us open to be wounded, to be wounded deeply, and to be, and to hit that, to reach that point where it's, it's harder for us to forgive and to be forgiven. And it's because we just, we become so nurturing and, and come so loving into relationships, so open. You know, we're very vulnerable people. I don't know about you, but I, when I become your friend, I'm your friend. I'm all in. I bear everything to you. I will tell you everything about me whether you want to hear it or not. I mean, by the time we finish today, you may be already done. Well, that was way more information than I needed. But I want to bear myself to you because I want to be, I want to open myself to you so that you can receive what God has for you. And I want to be his complete and total vessel to you.